Hello and welcome to another short video. In this video I want to show you how to add a chamfered corner to a building. And you probably don't know what a chamfer is. It's what you see in the picture there. It's when the edge or the corner of a building is worked in such a way that it isn't a 90 degree corner anymore. And I think it has something to do also um, when horse-drawn carriages were going around the corner. One possibility, and I've talked about them in previous videos, were jostle stones. But this one is a, another solution which I came across in Kilkenny. This is an example in Kilkenny, but I've also seen it in Great Namana and in Yall and in Timolik. I'll show you pictures of those. So this is what they look like. And since we're supposed to map the footprint of a building rather than actually the roof, um, we have to look at ground level to see this because you cannot ever see chamfers from satellite view. So you have to use um, ground truth, as we call it. So you have to go into the street and see it and say, OK, this is worth adding. It's a minute detail, but um, as it adds to the visibility while going around the corner, it might be important to add it to OpenStreetMap. So that's what we're going to do. So I'm on OpenStreetMap.org. I've zoomed in on the edge. It's the number one here in Chapel Avenue. And and I noticed it because when I was looking for benchmarks in Kilkenny, there was supposed to be one at this corner. And I presume there used to be a jostle stone at this corner. And for some reason, they decided that wasn't safe enough or I don't know. And they took it off and they instead chamfered the corner of the building. So um, once I get this to open, So there's the number one, and I'll just zoom in as much as possible. Obviously, I don't know exactly the dimensions of the chamfer, so I'm just going to guess. I'm just going to add a node here, but just double clicking on the line and then try to go the exact same distance on the other wall and double click there. And then I can just highlight the corner that isn't there and delete it. And that's all there is. And I'll save that and I'll say added chamfered corner. Oops, that's not how you spell corner. Source street imagery, I guess, because I took that picture. And I'll add a hashtag just because I have the time. Chamfer. So in case you want to do that, we can now look it up, how many have been done. And upload that. And it probably won't show on the regular zoom level, the highest zoom level on OpenStreetMap in the regular map view, because it's just tiny. Gonna have to wait a little bit. But it might show on the humanitarian, or if you have an app that uses OpenStreetMap and that uses a higher zoom level, it might show. Can you see it there that it's it's not a 90 degree angle or a corner there anymore? It's very hard to see. I'll try a different map view, different layer. The cycle one lets you zoom in a bit more, but it might not update as often. No. Well, it won't. But you saw it maybe in the standard layer that it's not a sharp corner anymore which helps when you have a horse-drawn carriage, who does? But also, again, as I said, when you go around the corner, it gives you a bit more visibility. And that's, I think, a town planning thing that's been going on since I read it here on Wikipedia, mid 19th century. So who knows if they did it for um, for pedestrians or for horse-drawn horse carriages. But there are some beautiful examples here. Pretty famous one here, the Fifth Avenue one in New York. And it's also used in furniture making. And I really like the name of this type. And you see that on buildings as well. It's called a lark's tongue. And yeah, that's all. See you in the next video. Thanks very much. Bye.